steps up military crackdown in Kurdish cities. The Islamic Republic has intensified its crackdown on anti-government protests in Kurdish areas with military vehicles deployed and live bullets used against people. Following violent clashes in the city of Mahabad on Saturday, a small Kurdish majority city in West Azerbaijan province, the people of other cities across the country, especially Kurdish ones held protests in solidarity with Mahabad. The majority of Iran's 10 million Kurds live in the western parts of the country. England and Wales backed down on One Love Captain armbands after FIFA sanctions threat. Well joyful scenes there, but really tense today as the England and World Chief are still discover if they can wear these One Love armbands. FIFA, wanting teams to wear football unites the world armbands, but doesn't feel very unified there today. But, there are still fans wanting to come to this World Cup first in the Middle East. Yeah, we heard yesterday that the FIFA abandoned the, uh, the band, so I don't know what he's going to, he's going to do today. I'm curious. Well, good luck getting your ticket. <laughs> yeah, um, as, as far as I'm aware, um, at this point, Harry's still wearing it. The FA are talking to, to FIFA at the moment and um, I'm sure by, by game time tomorrow they'll have their decision. Um, but yeah, I think we've made it clear that we, we want to wear it. England and Wales have backed down on wearing an armband supporting the LGBTQ plus community while playing in Qatar after the threat of sporting sanctions was raised by FIFA. As national federations, we can't put our players in a position where they could face sporting sanctions including bookings, so we have asked the captains not to attempt to wear the armbands in FIFA World Cup games. Islamic Republic step Some world leaders have said COP27 failed to deliver, but most leaders of poor countries are happy they'll now get compensation. It is a huge achievement to get an agreement to establish a loss and damage fund after 30 years of small island states, vulnerable countries.